because I've had plenty of products for, to review, but I just have not gotten to recording them. So this week I'm going to start with the most present item that I've been using and that I have absolutely fallen in love with. And I don't know why it has taken me so long to find, grab hold, and use, whatever you want to say. Oh, and yes, if y'all follow my vlog channel, y'all know all about uh, this. If not, go ahead, follow, you'll know. So, the product of reviewing today, the Black Opal Deluxe Finishing Powder. And I have it in the number three, medium. And it does have just a slight uh, bit of shimmer in it to me. And that's what I see. But when I tell y'all this lasts all day, because I had my makeup on Sunday from... I got up and did my makeup at like 6 o'clock in the morning, like 6.30. And I didn't get home until almost 8, I want to say. I, th I think almost 8 o'clock. That's 12 hours of makeup. I put this on top of my Becca. Amazing. I've put this on top of my Revlon Nearly Naked. Amazing. I've put it on top of my dog. What's the other one I put it on top of? I put it on top of my Dream at Moose. I've put it on top of Becca, red one, that. And it's another one I put it on top of. I don't remember. But those three, four, shiggity, I can attest. And it's like my perfect color. So what I'm gonna go do now, I'm going to go get more, all the colors. They're going into my, um, cause they don't get, they're going into my kit. They don't give me that uh, cast, and it just goes in so smooth. It, I prom I looked, I just felt like I looked flawless. Let me, let me turn this, cause this, my lights need to get it together. Okay, so, yes, today I did a little bit of a slight beat down, you know little tussle with a brush um but i use this and when i tell you how much time did i do my makeup noon and it's 11 and i still look i still look good i still look put together and it's not too light so and, I, and the thing is that's what i was gonna really say because i think if you're half you know i think this can work for a few shades because it's not too powdery like that pale it's not too pale that's the word I was looking for it's not too pale so y'all it's only eight dollars and do you see how much like I this one right here this Mac one it still gives me a cast and I'm like you're not supposed to this is supposed to be the bomb stuff uh, hit or miss and the this was not so eight dollars so I've started to, if I use this, I use it underneath. Like Wayne Gossi does, he says powder it first and then put your foundation and stuff on. I tried it that way, much better. But just to pop it on top, mm -mm. Mm -mm, it don't it don't work for me. So I would suggest for my women of color, especially my, you know, caramels, because I'm everybody's caramel. So my caramel ladies and, you know, this will definitely work for you. So try it out, eight bucks, no cast, all day, all matte, all fine, all flawless. You know what I'm saying? So check it out. Um, I'll actually I'll be putting up two product reviews today, so stay tuned for the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.